I was recently in my local branch of Screwfix, which is a big chain of what are basically hardware stores over here in the UK. And I noticed they had for sale some of these DeWalt multi-material quick change drill bits that are designed for use in an impact driver. They were $4.99, which I thought was pretty cheap for five what are basically masonry bits. Um, and with the added benefit that they can be used in an impact driver, I thought I'd give them a try. So I'm going to try them out. The bits come in different sizes from four to eight millimeters. They're in this quite a decent case that keeps them all separate. Um, the first thing that struck me was they're actually quite long, um, which is quite handy, but you'll have to be careful putting a lot of pressure on them. I've got a quarter inch hex fitting at one end. So the idea being that I can fit in a, an impact driver like this one. According to the case that they can drill in brick, PVC, I think that's concrete, um, and wood. If you haven't got a percussion or a specific drill for drilling in masonry, they, um, I suppose, will come in quite handy, save you forking out for a new drill. You can just spend five pounds on these bits. So let's give them a try. So this is the brick wall of my garage where I have my tools on the walls, as you can see. Um, I'm just going to drill a test hole in this to see how it copes with brick. I'm using the biggest bit that came, so eight millimeters, and I'm going to use it on the maximum speed. That was surprisingly easy, so it's impressed me. Just to show you, that's made a hole that's fine for a, for a blue plug. So I suppose the beauty of these multi-material bits is you can take it out, put in a, a standard bit in your impact driver, get your screw, And there you go. So I'm outside now and I found this 50 mil thick or two inches concrete paving slab. So I'm gonna try and drill through this. Again, I've got the eight mil bit in, in the impact driver on the fastest speed. So that's struggling a bit, if I'm honest. Um, it's not all the way through. It's probably about halfway. And uh, the, the motor of the impact driver is getting quite hot. And I can actually feel the, the impact trying to kick in. Let's try it with a, um, a thinner bit. So this is a five mil bit. That was much easier. Try a six mil. Yep, that worked fine. One well, last test, I've got this 10 volt impact driver. So it's a lot smaller and lighter, but I wonder if it'll still be able to go through this. So that got through fine, even with the little impact driver. I'm back in the garage now, and I thought I'd give it a try on some 
on some wood. Um, the bits in how they're designed predominantly look like the sort you'd use on masonry so I'll be interested to see how they get on with some wood. This is the 6mm bit. So actually, that went through quite well. So that seemed to drill quite well through the wood as well. Um, Probably not as easy as a specific wood bit, but nonetheless, I'm quite surprised with how well that's coped. So, if you were placing this directly on some masonry and you wanted to drill through the wood and into the masonry um, to get it all lined up properly, I'd say this would be perfect. In my opinion, these Dewalt quick change multi material bits are pretty good for five pounds which is basically a pound each for a bit I don't think you can go wrong they're never going to be as good as a specific masonry bit in a percussion or SDS hammer drill but in terms of what they can do especially with this like up to about six mil bit size in an impact driver in concrete masonry brick and wood I don't think you can go wrong at all so I'm, I'm quite pleased with them and uh, I can see myself using them quite a lot the added benefit of being able to just switch them in and out of an impact driver when you're up a ladder or something like that I think is going to be invaluable to a lot of people. I'm not a professional so probably won't be as useful to me but in times when I just want one tool with me, a screwing bit and a drilling bit then I don't think I'm going to have any qualms about picking these up and taking them with me. As far as I'm aware there are other manufacturers that make the multi-material bits. I think Bosch makes some that are meant to be particularly good but from the research that I've done they're considerably more expensive than these DeWalt ones so in some cases I suppose you get what you pay for but for my needs these are going to be perfect that's the end of the video I hope you found it useful if you did feel free to give it a thumbs up if you're not a subscriber already please feel free to subscribe to my channel and if you're interested in one of the reasons that I run this channel, there'll be a link to one of the charities that I'm trying to raise money for this year around here. So have a look at that. And if you feel like donating to the worthy cause, then it'd be fantastic if you could do so. Hopefully see you again soon.